Okay, on today's episode of Chef Jeff's Breakfast, I'm going to make a chili omelet. Got to cook the, cook the egg, about four eggs, sort of slowly, nice and slow so you don't burn it. Going to have some uh, leftover chili in there. And one thing you want to do a little bit, is just sort of reheat your chili a little bit so it doesn't have to reheat all the way in your omelet. That's what I like to do. Now what I did was, I toasted me up some hash browns. And if you're going to put some hash browns in your omelet, you want to make them sort of a little bit crispy. A little bit crispy like that. Gonna look really good. Gonna be really good in here. I got them on warm. I got some pre-cooked bacon. I got some pre-sliced green onion and some some green uh, pepper and some onions. And I also sauteed some onions and some green pepper and some garlic. Got some cheese already grated up. Like to have all my stuff pre-done here. Now, what I like to do is put some of that stuff right in my omelet. Sauteed green peppers and sauteed green onion, sauteed garlic. Put that right in there. There's nothing in the world don't feel good with bacon. Got to have a little bacon. The bottom of the omelets looking a little bit like it's getting done, so looking good there now. I had these staying warm too. One thing you want to do is have some crispy. There's nothing wrong with a little bit of hash brown in your omelet. So you just want to crisp them up a little bit. Put that, oh, put that hash brown right in your omelet. Sort of like a... You had a burrito, breakfast burrito, same thing, but it's an omelet. Put that in there. And I like to put just a little bit of non-sauteed onion and green pepper in there too. That's good flavor. And then go ahead and put some uh, cheese in there. Can't have omelet without cheese. Look at that. That's beautiful. Beautiful. Don't forget, add a little bit of chili. Oh, there's nothing better. Anything that's left over can go in your omelet in the morning. Anything left over can be made for breakfast. Ooh. The only thing I got a problem with there is probably not big enough of omelet. We'll see. Might as well put a little more tomato on there. I got some cut up tomato. Put that in there. Now, that's about it is. Oh man, I don't know if you can see that, but that. Oh, 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 oh man, that's gonna be good. Then, I think you might want to put a little more cheese on top of the top of the chili. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. I like to eat as I go. Damn. There's the tricky part. Might need two of these. They're sliding around nicely. Had a little bacon grease and butter in the bottom. Oh man, how are we going to do this? Spin it the right way. Oh, beautiful. Oh, man. That's about done already. Mm. Oh yeah, that's gonna be beautiful. I've got my plate ready here. What am I missing? You know what I'm missing on top. I think you should just wait because I already got my chili preheated. See, that way you put a little bit on top and it ain't gonna be cold. Mm -mm -mm. That's leftover chili from last night. Don't forget, I got some chicken delicious going in the crock pot here for dinner already. This is ready already. Oh, yeah. You don't want to have your heat up too high when you cook an omelet. I mean to tell you, that is one big old omelet right there. Mm -mm -mm. You always want the inside of your omelet to get done, so. Oh, yeah. Well, that's going to be way too much for me. So I'm going to cut that in half right now. 
Oh, yeah. Okay, that's looking good. Then, while that's done, basically what you do, put it on your plate like this here. side even though we don't need them. Now first thing you know what you gotta, you gotta do is get your toast going. Now that you're topping off your food get your toast on. A little more cheese. A little more salt and pepper. Got a little bit left over sauteed. Onions, green pepper, sauteed garlic. Oh man, a little extra. I don't, don't want to do that yet because I want to put just a splash more chili on the top. Oh yeah. Then you got your tomatoes on top. I mean, this is going to be perfect. I mean, perfect. One thing I like to put on mine, just for myself. A little bit of sour cream on top of that. We are good to go. Just a dollop. Is that what you call that? A dollop? Just a little bit. Mm -hmm. That is what you call a perfect, perfect omelet. Just in time. Toast is done. Now, a little bit too much. Let's check this out here. I tell you what. This is what you call the perfect leftover chili omelet. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm talking beautiful. Man, I'm good.